I was still trying to figure out who I was. And I think it becomes that the more comfortable you are with yourself and how you are and who you are, the easier it becomes to teach others. One of the biggest challenges is yourself, basically. And the other challenge is knowing or, or having a belief system about how to teach. David Noonan once said, that students learn in spite of what you do. Everything we do needs to be governed by our students' needs and interests. If you have passion and interest, and if you're prepared to give it a shot, and you maintain that energy and enthusiasm, it's hard to resist. It's hard to not just give up and join in in the end. I like teaching. I think it's fun. I'm interested in communication, I'm interested in people, I'm interested in culture, I'm in sharing and learning from my students, about my students. So it's, and of course, when you see somebody making progress, getting a PhD from the university, and that's just pleasing to see. Teaching, we put a lot into it, and it takes a lot out of us. And one form of meditation was running, a dynamic meditation. When you're in the zone, your mind empties. It empties, but at the same time, it focuses and produces answers for you. Teach on the edge, because there's instability and unpredictability and possibility. So I, I certainly believe that effective, interesting teaching is often done on your feet, seeing opportunities in the moment good teacher are the characteristics of a good person and, and one's outcomes for others that benefit the others, not the teacher, but that person, the student. The trick is to try and find a way for those learners to start to believe in themselves. And part of that is guiding them towards some place where they can feel better about things. They don't just have to inhabit the negativity where they currently are, taking them to places where there are resources or possibilities. One of the problems is we live in this dichotomous culture, this black and white view of the world. It doesn't reflect the world as we know it to be, and it certainly doesn't reflect what we know about the field we're in. So for me, one of the guiding principles is just efficiency. What, what works best? Or what have we got time for? 